Today is October 13th. Okay, I just got out of church. I'm going to be using my 3 inch Kite 6 swim bait and a 16th ounce head. The DBC 1 on my tail lock rod. 4 pound sun light sniper. Fluorocarbon. I'm in South Elgin, so it's going to be a quick session. I got to get my fishing in. Let's see what we can get done. There we go. Wasn't expecting that. Oh wow, I was just kind of wasn't very very helpful. I gotta adjust my drag. There we got it a little tighter now. We hit that uh, three inch contact. This guy's speeding. You can tell he's a little chubby. Oh Jesus! Can't get a hand down. Down from the bottom. There we go. 325. There it is. I wasn't expecting a whole lot from this little area. I was about to move on. The reason I tell uh, these kite tanks are not the best. They, they get tore up real easy. But they didn't tie spice. I should have maybe tied something else on a little differently. A one or two fish. <laughs> Church, I think I hit another spot. I'm not wearing the right shoes for this. So this will probably be the last spot at least for this morning. It looks like we got a storm front coming through. <coughs> One thing that did catch my attention at South Elgin is all these signs that says save our dam. So I'm not sure if they're thinking about a dam removal down there. I'm not sure, but there's signs all over the place, so I'm going to fish this little spot up here. Like I said, I'm not wearing the right shoes. I'm wearing my Sunday shoes. Right, let me get a leader to see if I can catch anything. Catch the one fish. The only thing I got, got me thinking was, was remove Save Our Dam signs in South Elgin. Are you thinking dam removal? Look into it. It's a wrap for today.